guys, welcome back to Hate's Fear channel. My name is Fear, and you guys are watching Hate. It is reviewing time. To those who are new to this channel, please do consider subscribing to Hate's Fear channel as I release geek and tech related videos every week. And to those who are watching that have already subscribed to Hate's Fear channel, Welcome back. Okay guys, so for this week's episode of Hey, it is reviewing time. Aku akan buat uh, a bit different. Uh, I'm going to do a first impression review of a product yang aku baru je beli and aku akan tunjukkan korang the unboxing and apa ada dalam kotak and everything. But before that, I'm going to show you guys where I bought it and uh, the whole journey of me trying to find that thing. So, let's go. Okay guys, so sekarang aku dekat 9th Avenue ni live. Uh, mission aku hari ni adalah aku nak cari Uh, mechanical keyboard and mission aku adalah aku nak cari keyboard yang selain blue switch uh, type of keyboard and aku kalau boleh nak cari keyboard yang boleh custom dia punya RGB dekat software and aku kalau boleh nak cari keyboard yang ada pump rest tak kisahlah macam mana pun so kat sini ada popular bookstore aku akan pergi masuk and tengok what kind of keyboard that they can offer and kat sini juga ada satu kedai PC My IT so without wasting any time let's go Aku dah pergi dekat popular bookstore uh, Diorang ada mekanik keyboard ke tag Tapi keyboard tu uh, Tak ada palm rest So aku akan pergi my IT untuk tengok Kalau diorang ada keyboard yang macam aku nak Aku dah pun beli aku punya mechanical keyboard yang baru And Keyboard yang aku beli is Razer Ornata Chroma Yes guys Ah. Okay eventually I went a bit over budget Sebab aku punya budget is around 250 to 300 bucks Aku tak pernah ada Razer punya product actually This is my first ever Razer product So yeah Dia ada pump rest yang cushion Itu yang paling best sekali As you guys know I've work like in front of the PC for like almost 15 to 16 hours a day so uh, convenience and comfortability is very very important guys so so I'll see you guys in the studio aku akan unbox this and aku akan bagi korang my first impression for the Razer Ornata Chroma Mechanical Keyboard so yes guys macam korang nampak dalam video yang aku baru tunjuk tadi I actually bought a new mechanical keyboard for me for my work purposes uh, sometimes a bit of gaming purposes which is Razer Ornata Chroma Mechanical Gaming Keyboard Okay, so aku akan unbox keyboard ni depan korang And without wasting any time Jom unbox Okay, so first of all, kita buka dulu benda lah ni Alright Okay, so buka-buka je uh, Terus straight forward the keyboard And then ada some user guide and also thank you card Which aku akan buka keluar Okay, so first of all, ada thank you card daripada co-founder, CEO and creative director of Razer Okay And, korang akan dapat uh, Razer Ornato Chroma punya quick guide, of course And of course, sticker Razer Okay So, nothing Wow, nice So nice guys Aku tak pernah ada Razer punya product So this is a total new experience for me Okay so this is how the keyboard looks like Ah, Okay, 
Hmm. Okay, so dia pakai uh, nylon braided uh, USB cable and gold plated USB Type A. Yes, gold plated USB. And belakang ni dia ada um, to adjust dia punya level of the keyboard. Okay, and then of course, guys. Ha, the cushion uh, wrist rest. Palm rest, wrist rest, mana-mana pun boleh lah Ok, aku buka sekejap Oh, this is so nice guys Ya, yeah, cushion Ah, uh, This is one of the One of the main reason kenapa aku nak beli keyboard ni lah Ok, so that's about it dalam kotak ni Ah, uh, Except for this foam yang tak rasa aku nak tahu pun Ok, aku akan set up dulu keyboard ni And Aku akan bagi tahu korang kenapa aku beli keyboard ni My first impression for this keyboard And aku akan uh, Bagi tahu korang kat mana aku beli And berapa harga dia So Okay guys, aku dah pun set up aku punya new Razer Ornata Chroma. First of all, kenapa? Why? Why did I choose this keyboard instead of um, lagi banyak keyboard and everything? I've always wanted a mechanical keyboard yang boleh custom, have a customizable software for the lightings. And also, aku nak keyboard yang ada a number pad. As you guys remember from my last video in the Armageddon keyboard, aku mention yang how much I actually use that number pad. And bila benda tu tak ada dekat keyboard yang Armageddon tu, it's quite a uh, hassle for me lah. But now it's back, I can use it back. And also, aku nak try a uh, mechanical keyboard that use other than the blue switch type of uh, mechanical switch. This one actually use Razer punya special uh, mechanical membrane punya switch. Aku tak tahu sama ada benda ni betul-betul bagus ke tak because this is only the first impression of video. And also guys, another thing yang tak ada dekat keyboard lama aku yang ada dekat keyboard ni is of course the wrist rest ataupun palm rest. Cuma satu benda lah yang aku agak concern sebab wrist rest ni uh, sangat selesa dan uh, material dia cushion. Sebab aku ada kucing. So, aku takut yang dia akan cakar benda ni. But then again guys, aku baru tahu yang benda ni actually attach and detachable via magnet. Can you see how how easy it is? Just like Just like that, I can take it off, keep it. Bila aku nak tidur, and bila aku nak pakai, aku bawa keluar. It just <laughs> sorry guys, kalau aku cakap over excited, aku tahu keyboard ni dah lama keluar. It's just that I never had the chance to use any mechanical keyboard from Razer or even their mouses because frankly, produk orang memang mahal. And aku sebelum ni memang tak beberapa mampu lah untuk pakai uh, mechanical keyboard ni. Uh, so yeah. The setup was very easy. Korang plug je dah laptop korang and directly Razer akan notify yang korang dah pakai produk dia and dia akan terus pop up dia punya uh, software, the Razer Synapse. Uh, so korang install, just uh, install dekat korang punya uh, PC or Mac or laptop and everything. And directly korang dah boleh straight away use the Synapse software and kat sini aku nak cakap yang aku sangat uh, impressed dengan Synapse software. Razer Mungkin sebab aku tak pernah guna other high-end punya gaming keyboard So aku tak tahu how they work Because usually all of my mechanical keyboard is just uh, Programmable dekat keyboard Tak ada software So this is the first mechanical keyboard yang aku boleh uh, custom and everything And dia ada quick um, quick setup Which korang just boleh pilih uh, choice of breathing ke Ripple effect, fire effect and everything dekat situ And dia ada satu lagi advanced setup Which is actually dia punya um, We can say like a studio Studio dalam dia punya software tu where korang boleh customizable every single keycap What kind of colors you guys want, what kind of effect you guys want Berapa lama korang nak effect tu bergerak and then change to another effect Korang boleh buat semua tu Aku akan try and maybe in my full review of this um, keyboard Aku akan bagi tahu apa aku punya thoughts and opinions about the software secara overall So guys dekat mana sebenarnya aku beli keyboard ni, berapa harga dia So aku beli keyboard ni dekat uh, satu PC store dekat My IT Dekat 9 Avenue Nilai Um, orang Sepang dengan orang nilai mesti tahu Nine Avenue kat mana Ada satu kedai PC dekat atas tu nama kedai tu MyIT So dia jual keyboard ni Retail price dia sebenarnya dekat kedai tu RM389 Tapi tadi tengah on sale so dia dia jual for like only RM325 Which I consider cheap for product like Razer And aku rasa 
It's about time aku try something yang uh, premium and comfortable Untuk aku juga sebab aku duduk depan PC like almost uh, 16 hours a day I do all of my works in front of PC So I need devices and gadgets yang bagi aku comfort So aku tak penat lah bila aku edit video ke edit gambar ke everything So yeah So bagus atau tidak pembelian aku ni Aku tak boleh judge sekarang I'm gonna use it for about good one month And after that aku akan mungkin release aku punya full review on this keyboard So if you guys wanted to see Stay tuned Like this video as a sign of support yang korang semua nak tahu aku punya full review on this keyboard So guys that's about it for this week's episode of Hey It Is Reviewing Time Aku dah pun bagi aku punya first impression review for the Razer Ornata Chroma I'll see you guys in the next video definitely don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and like I have always said guys remember to always do great be great and stay great hey it's fear walking off